Okay, so I'm going to go and show you how to get a sample into the IMPC uh, quick and dirty without having to use any expensive, let's say, Cubasis and Audio Bus with three or four different Korgs all routed virtually. There's a quick and easy way to do this, uh, especially when you don't have the Sonoma Audio Paste protocol available to an application. You can use an application like Audio Share and your email. So that's my advice is to use an email and do audio uh, copy and paste. I'm gonna show you how that works. So if you open up your email, you find, uh, let's see, there's that strum from the guitar. Instead of playing in QuickTime, you hold down, and then you see I have about 10 different programs that will open this up. I'm gonna open up an audio share. I'm gonna go ahead and click audio copy to pasteboard. And voila, then open the IMPC back up. Now I'm gonna go to a program I made, edit that. So you can see I already have this put in there, but for the sake of showing you how to do this and without uh, being redundant and iterative, I'm gonna show you how to put one in and then, you know, that's uh, how I do it. So if you go in, um, to new sound and then click audio paste, then voila, from the paste board. Now, there's a little click at the end, I don't know if you heard that, but if you adjust the end point down 1.5 seconds, and then make sure you select a category in the metadata so that it will organize your files inside folders without doing this or with using the iTunes file sharing input. You get thousands of samples with no folders and it's a major headache. So I prefer to use this um, audio copy uh, and paste method. Let's say that's in there. And let's just go and show you how I uh, set this up. So this is an E flat major scale. So I have the guitar. And they're all uh, by measure, so think of this as four measures. This row is is uh, the first uh, of the scale, second, third, and fourth, and what have you. So I'm gonna go and show you how I would just record the guitar in and um, you know strum it with a note repeater, what have you, and uh, that'll be about it. But let's uh, go. Something went weird there. Let's uh, make sure I have that track erased. Mm, that wasn't perfect. We can get it closer. So we can use the time correct and fix that, but I like to put in <clears throat> the sort of uh, uh, picks first before I do the strumming. So I'm gonna show you how I do the strumming. <clears throat> so first I'm just gonna lay in the basic strum. Dun, 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 dun. Then I'm gonna use a note repeat and show you how you can build up a little bit more dynamic um, chord uh, progressions with this. I just like to time correct as I go along. Um, let's put note repeat on the eighth note. <clears throat> now, add a little bit of a stutter strum. And uh, let's uh, correct that. And 
And then on another uh, channel here, I have another track. I have these chords. A loop. Um, build. Line. So that's how I go and formulate a track is is uh, usually by these measures, but uh, I mix it up sometimes, you know. Um, I'm gonna put these chords in. Same thing. Dun 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 dun. One two three four. Then a little dit 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 stutter to make it sound like it's uh, you know a little guitar, and then we got it. Even though this is more of a house chord stab, but you know you get the idea. Time to correct that. Well, I find that, uh, let's undo that. The little stutter is just a little too much, so I'm just going to put this in regular. And, uh, you know, that's how I put it in, and then I go ahead and, and arrange it in different uh, sequences. You see I have the tutorial, um, which is basically the tutorial with the beat, the bridge, bridge build. Uh, these are just keep copying um, sequences and then changing them. And, uh, yeah, I'll, sh I'll show you how it, how it sounds. I mean, it's uh, still working on it, but um, here we go. So something happened with my build up there. Jeez, that didn't sound right. Put that back up that da ba da da ba da um so that totally didn't drop right. Um Still only missing this uh in my build up, so I'll show you how I put that in there. My build It's in there and that one, why didn't it go in here? Alright, so let's try it again. For whatever reason it didn't want to play. You know, it's a freaking toy on the iPad, but hey, I like uh, working this way.
for some, you know, I still got to work on it. Uh, the build up it just didn't sound exactly right. Got to get the uh, levels or what have you. Just wanted to show you how the audio copy works. Then I work on, you know, going through and, and sequencing because I like sequencing on the IMPC, uh, I, I but there's no song thing, so I like to actually do this inside of. Um, tabletop that way I can actually side chain my bass to my uh, kick and uh, do a lot more effects and stuff but so that's it